Like many fans of classic Thomas, I always have a strong appreciation for Thomas's visual fidelity throughout its first couple of seasons. It felt like a real place, and it just had a beauty to it all. Today, though, in the Halloween spirit, I thought it'd be cool to talk about the horror theme and how Classic Thomas was able to successfully master making a horror-looking series. The way Sodor is presented at night always gave it this eerie feel to it. Hearing the owls hooting, that mysterious music, it just sends spines down your children's throat. Just seeing Sodor call a verdant fog always gives it this eerie thing of, you never know what's there. Heck, this example from Stephanie Gets Lost is a good one, where Stephanie is revealed to be in a scrapyard, only to be nearly brutally murdered by the Iron Twins. I feel lighting is also something prominent. Seeing those dark reds in a place like the scrapyard really gets your nerves boggling. Oh boy, is he gonna die? Other little things that added to this atmosphere is hearing owl food, or seeing little chains at the bottom, or even the remains of an engine long past. These all helped give Thomas this vibe of an unfeelingness, somewhere you don't want to be. Though to me, out of all the strengths horror had for Thomas, I'd say none have always been more than the music. The background music and sounds have always helped heighten the fear of the series. It's given every, like, scene you're in a tense and suspenseful feel. Unfortunately, I can't play any of it, but if you've seen any of these episodes, I'm sure these images can just ring that spooky song to it. It gives that feeling of, oh my, we're here, we're at this point. Alright, that's the video. I hope you guys liked it. I like talking about Thomas and the spooky nature around it. But don't go anywhere just yet. There's something special at the end I want you all to see. Mm-hmm. <laughs>